Hey guys, it's Chef Baker. I got some sad news for those of you who like my Gears of War 3 content. I'm probably going to end up still playing it anyways, even though I've said this a billion times, but I'm, my last montage is coming up. But I have a feeling that uh, Gears of War 3 is going to call me back a couple more times. I'll end up getting that. Uh, one more montage. Right? But, yeah, so maybe this is the second last montage, is what I'm trying to say. Uh, it's just been it's been it's been difficult trying to get clips because my like lately my connection has just been so bad like, choppy so it's just, like not even worth playing like I remember this one game I got a triple kill and then uh at, halfway through the game my connection started going to shit I was just flying all over the place and was glitching and lagging and I was just like hey, you know, I'm gonna get it off this damn game and uh, play something else or something because I just cannot handle it when it's, the connection's out of but yeah so my one last montage is coming out. Maybe it's my second last shell or second last sword. But yeah, it's gonna be called Wicked. I'm gonna put some pretty good clips in there. I got quite a few clips. I might break it up to two parts. It depends on how long it's. I always tend to make my montage a little too long. A little too epic. Like I like putting all the, the shit I got into one video. Like the the clutches and mini clutches and head pops and triples and nice doubles, you know, stuff like that. But, um yeah, when it comes to Gears of War 4 and um, Gears of War Ultimate Edition, I'm definitely going to sh shorten my montage so I can keep pumping out content constantly. Because I don't want to let you guys down and have you waiting for a long time. I want to be entertaining all of you. So, yeah, that's that. Um, So, write in the comments how excited. Obviously, I'm probably super duper like, mega excited for the newest montage coming out. Because, I mean, not montage. The newest Gears of War coming out. Like, well, technically, it's not new. But still, like I cannot wait for the Gears of War Ultimate Edition. It just looks so nice. The graphics actually look better than Gears of War 3. Yeah, that, yeah I'd actually say that. <coughs> Ooh, backstab. But yeah, I was just so impressed with the game when I played the beta. I can't wait for the actual thing. Just like I think there's eight new chapters in the campaign, so I'll probably I'm gonna do a walkthrough. It's not probably I will do a walkthrough, but Gears of War 1. Oh, that's just three new missions. That's just awesome. I was watching the videos on the Gears of War YouTube channel. When they remaking the cog and the, the locust video, I like the locust video especially because they made Ram look so badass. Like he's, I like how they have Gears of War One keeps that gritty feel and like that kind of you're t terrified of these things coming out of the ground. It's not just like locusts that are just you know like look at this game for example. It just looks so bright and they're not as creepy as they should be. You know, like even the Raven Down map looks like awesome. Like it's not winter time. Well, it's cool as winter time in this. Now that I think about it, you know, but in the Gears of War 1 map, it looks pretty badass because it's all like summertime or fall or whatever it is, and uh, like, it just looks so gritty and like, like kind of, the mood is perfect for Gears of War, that's how they should have kept it throughout the series, but hopefully if they remake Gears of War 2 and 3, if there's a good input, you know, a bunch of people like hopping onto the, what you call it, Gears of War Ultimate Edition and like, Let's say the Gears of War all condition is like the Gears game just explodes and like, you know, there's like, for me, like 6,000 people in Team Deathmatch at most and then 1,200, 1,500, like I don't know, 1,500, but in, uh, King of the Hill gets like 1,500, but it's probably about almost 10,000 players, but imagine if it, Gears of War, that was the one that just exploded and a bunch of people came back to Gears of War and I don't know, it'd be, it'd be awesome having like, regular players there's a lot of players I, I face online they're actually pretty damn good like well-rounded players especially if you're uh, facing a stacked team like, even if it's a three-man squad four-man squad you're just totally fucked because they'll, they'll be backing each other up and stuff but hopefully that's the gears of war that all oh, apologies here I, was like, I have to get it i kind of reloaded bounced and shot it was i think it was on purpose but it kind of looks like an accident because i remember i see the mark turn around and I like reload, I was focusing on my reload, like looking up at the bar, and then, oh this is nice, wait for it, oh yeah, no metal load, just a weird it pop, but anyways, yeah, I was looking at the bar, I, I turned uh, towards the mark, and then I bounced and shot, and I was like, when I bounced and shot, I kind of pointed down, because I noticed he went to the ground, and it was just kind of like, trying to keep my aim on point, you know what I'm saying, like, but it didn't click, like, oh, that wasn't my damn. But, oh well. I always try and pay people back. Like, if I get a nice string of kills, like double kill and there's a triple right there, I'll just kind of 
borrow kill. I don't call it kill stealing because I always tell them I'll owe you one, and I usually do. Sometimes I'll give them a two, like I'll down a guy and then mark him on the ground so my teammate can take him. But yeah, if it's a retro kill, like if a guy retro downs someone, I'll just walk up to him and pop his head and I'll, I'll teabag because I straight up don't like the retro. Like if you're using it and you down someone and I'm there, I'll probably take it. But Karma's gonna come back to me, but. Then again, I'm, that's probably repaying karma because you're using a retro. And on top of that, oh shit, the commentary's ready to go. Anyways, peace you guys, I'll talk to you later. Sorry, I just wanted to make a video for you guys. Hope you enjoyed.